Hi guys, so today I'm filming the Tan Lines tag, and if you recognize me in this shirt with this lipstick with my hair up already, yes, I pre-filmed another video, which was my July favorite, so I will link it somewhere on the screen that you can click and go uh, check it out. So I'm just going to get started with this tag because, yeah, I'm just excited and I love tags and I want to answer some of these questions. Before I start, I just wanted to say thank you Nicole, which is Beauty Music of 18 here on YouTube. She tagged me to do this video and I love being tagged to do videos. So thank you Nicole for tagging me and I'm just gonna get on started. So the first question is beach house or lake house? And I really gotta think about this one because as much as I love the beach, I like lakes too, but I feel like, I feel like beaches are a little cleaner, but on some circumstances that may not necessarily be true so if it was my choice I'd say beach house second question is favorite summer hairstyle and you're looking at it just a, a messy bun yeah because it's so hot and humid and gross out and sweaty and ugh, that I just want my hair off my shoulders and not getting all gross the third question is do you tan or burn and this is kind of a mixed kind of question I get tanned and burned um where you know, kind of changes every time, but I get burned usually on my shoulders, the back here, my neck, uh, under my eyes, and sometimes on my neck here. I tan everywhere else, so like on my arms, legs, stomach, um, the rest of my face other than this part here that I get burnt. Um, yeah, back, lower back. Question number four, have you ever gotten a henna tattoo? I have gotten a henna tattoo. I've gotten a henna tattoo twice. The first time it was like when I was maybe in grade four or five, I want to say. So uh, I remember it was a monkey and it was on like my ankle and it was like a pretty big monkey too. I was obsessed with monkeys. Um, I still am. I have a ton of monkey stuffed animals. So I got that one done. And then recently, like this past, like maybe a month back or something, I went to Canada's Wonderland, which is kind of like Six Flags, um, it's like a roller coaster place, outdoor place, park, amusement park thing, and my friend Megan and I, and I think I've mentioned Megan so many times now in the videos I filmed today, um, we went there together and we got henna tattoos at a henna stand, and we got infinity signs on our wrists, obviously they washed off by now, and I got her initials and she got mine, so it's like a little friendship cheesy thing so we got that question number five bonfires or night swimming by the way i apologize if i keep looking down i got the computer right on my lap um so i think i prefer night swimming just because i like the feel of that more and bonfires as much as i like those two and i love roasting marshmallows and making s'mores bonfires um the smoke from it makes you like it's kind of sticks to your clothes and it, the stench is kind of bad so and messy with the marshmallows sticking and everything, so I would prefer to go night swimming. Question number six, if you could travel anywhere over the summer, where would it be and why? And that's a no-brainer, I'd want to go to Bora Bora, which is like a tropical place, kind of like Hawaii. Or I'd go to California, because I've never been to either of the places and they seem amazing to me. Question number seven, bikinis, tankinis, or one-piece bathing suits? And me, I would go for bikinis. Um, obviously they're better to tan and stuff, so... The material of the bathing suit covers less of your body that sounds really bad but i mean like um one pieces i like to wear when i have a swim course to do and i have to dive into the water and stuff so my um when i wear a bikini my bikini bombs tend to fly off when i dive into the water um so yeah i prefer bikinis but when i'm doing certain things uh even going like tubing and stuff my bikini bombs will fly off so one pieces are better for that number eight summer makeup must-haves um, I think I would just go for mascara, liquid liner, and a bright lip. Um, I don't like to wear a lot of heavy makeup during summer unless I'm working or have like a party or an outing to go to. I don't wear a ton, um, like a full face. Uh, most people would say waterproof mascara, but I hate waterproof mascara because it is so hard to get off. And if I go swimming, I'm not wearing any makeup, so I never buy waterproof mascara. Number nine, hot as it's been over the summer where you live. So we measure our temperature in degrees. So maybe the hottest I think it'd be is probably 35 degrees and I'm too lazy to convert that. So however hot that is in America, whatever. That's how hot it is here in Canada in the place I live. Question number 10, do you play any sports over the summer? And that is a no. Question number 11, have you ever had a summer fling? No. 
Question number 12, number one thing on your summer bucket list. I haven't, I don't really have a summer bucket list. I don't really follow those kind of things. Question number 13, long hair or short hair over the summer? Personally, I am all for short hair. I think it's great, a great change, especially for the summer when you get your long hair chopped off and get it shorter. So easier to take care of, not so damaged, whatever. And I totally applaud and I'm all for the people that can pull off the short hair. But for me, I've tried it once. The shortest I've been was probably shoulder shoulder length, other than when I was little and it was like chin length. I don't like short hair on myself, so for me, I'd say long hair. Question 14, do you wear makeup while at the pool, beach, or lake? So I kind of already answered this question with the waterproof mascara. I wear no makeup at the pool or the beach or the lake. If I know I'm going to be outside or in the water for a long period of time, I'm definitely not going to put on my foundation, blush, contour, put my bright pink lipstick on. And number 15, worst summer memory. And I can't really think of a worst summer memory because most of my summers have been pretty good, knock on wood. I can't really think that far back that I had something bad happen in the summertime because summer is all about relaxing and having fun spending time with your friends and family and um, it's supposed to be stress free so that concludes this tag that was kind of short for me I guess my shortest tag I've ever done so thank you guys so much for watching comment down below and leave comments on what videos you guys would like to see me put up whether it's back to school videos or fashion videos or how to style certain things hauls I don't know anything you guys want um, I'm pretty much willing to film. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.